Good morning. Today is Wednesday morning, uh, February the 16th, and it's just about 20 after 6 in the morning, 6.20 a.m. <laughs> anyway, we are going to go upstairs and start working in the bakery here at the Bella. Heading this way. <clears throat> I'm the only one here. Just open the place up. Nobody else will be here till about 8. Here is the Bella Wall of Fame. And that's me. Yes. Me, October month. <laughs> October employee of the month for 2010. Not sure why my picture is still up there and it's already February of, all of 11, so... Anyway, here we go. Heading up the stairs. This is where the bakery's at. I haven't been up here yet. We got a nice big fire door on the stairs here. <coughs> Let's open her up. I haven't been here since Sunday. So we'll try to see what we got going on here. Hopefully it won't be too big of a disaster. This dark up here. I won't turn the lights on for a few minutes yet. Ah, oh, these are the swinging doors to why you can even see it. Let's go out here on the balcony facing Main Street. We've got a bunch of tables set up here. <coughs> we'll snap the lights on on the way back. Okay, let's go out here and take a look around Jacksonville. Early morning traffic heading from Rouge to Medford is what all those lights are. This is downtown Jacksonville. Pretty dead. Nothing's opened up yet. I'm probably the only one here in town that has went to work. Look at that big black cloud. <coughs> We have a storm coming in, possibly, or it started raining yesterday. That is a black cloud, isn't it? That is just, uh, that's hanging over the talent, Phoenix talent area. That is a big black cloud. They are predicting snow today in the mountains and I can see in that direction I can see the top of Timber Mountain there probably about five miles from here it does have snow on it right there in the middle of the picture way back there but camera probably can't see that let's head in start turning some lights on here and Get into the bakery. Alrighty. Light switch. It's over here. Oh, my glasses are left over here. <coughs> Alrighty, this is a small banquet room. Or what they call small upstairs. There's the swinging doors to the bakery. That's the stairs that we just came up. Now let's light up this side. Ooh, boy, they put different tables up here. Usually they're big old uh, 10 foot rounds. They got something different going on up here. Alrighty. I didn't see anything on the books today for this. It might be for the next day or something. Looking out the window. The back stairs door. And there's the bakery right through there. It's a very pleasant place to work up here. <clears throat> Alright, first thing I'm going to do is turn the lights on. 
and turn that hood off so it'll kind of warm up in here a little bit. Here is my proofing box, which is completely empty. My oven, which I need to fire. And here is my main proofing box, which should have yesterday's bread in it. And it does. That's the bread that Lisa made yesterday. Cannonballs. And that's a good amount of bread for today. Plus, I think, five loaves downstairs. We need to turn that on once we take that out of there. This is the bakery. This is my other oven. These don't belong here. I don't know why they just got left there. We'll just move them aside. This place is prep list that she did yesterday. She's my assistant baker and she works on my day job. Let's get a key. So we can unlock my regions, but first let's go over here. Alright, we have, there's my swinging doors going outside. I've got two loaves of cranberry bread up here. These were made by Lisa yesterday. They look really good. And over here, turn on a light to the pizza part of the bakery. We make pizza dough up here. That's our pizza rolling machine. And I got a small freezer over here. I've got a couple of mud pies in there. One's all cut up and ready to go. Things are looking pretty darn good at this point. Now I need to get into my my uh, reach ins here and take a look and see what I got in here. This is where all my desserts are kept. Well, that's one of them. There's my key on the floor. Alrighty, my creme brulee is gone. This is some Sunday brunch stuff here. Alrighty. Ugh. Too old to be bending down this time of the morning. <laughs> Unlock this side. Ooh, and in here, this would have been left over for from Mother's and Mother's Day. We left over from uh, uh, Valentine's Day, which I wasn't here. That was my day off. This is stuff that Chef would have been making. We got a bunch of melted chocolate, some white chocolate, some regular chocolate. We have a New York cheesecake that Lisa made yesterday. That's wonderful. And I got two banana pies here. Banana macadamia nut pies. So I'm in good shape there. And I got a silk pie up here. So I'm in really good shape. I probably should make creme brulee today since we're kind of low. So let's go ahead and fire my bottom oven. Because that's where the creme brulee is going to be. So I'm looking at a pretty good day today. Not going to be too heavy. It's going to be pretty easy really. We'll probably be out of here by noon. We'll be making probably a half a batch of bread, creme brulee, and I don't really know what else but the other math, uh, probably some pie shells and pie dough, things like that. So it's going to be a pretty easy day. So that's what I do five days a week. I come in and I open the place up and then get started up here and then leave. I pretty much work up here by myself. I will have a dough roller working on this table 
rolling bread on certain days when we're extremely busy. And I'll have a prep cook working over there making uh, fresh, fresh uh, pie shells. Or, not pie shells. Pizza dough. <laughs> pizza dough. We have great pizza here, very popular. So that's it. Maybe come back and do this again during the summer when we have a busier day. So, uh, until then, God bless you, babe.